Yo, what's up, show boy fell Hey, uh, welcome back to Gran Turismo 7. Today we are back with another track experience. For this one, we are gonna take a look at Lake Louise. It's actually the newest map that they've added from the uh, latest update, so I actually like this one. So it's a snow one, so yeah, really nice. And yeah, lots of sliding for this one. Really, really, really cool. And I am still using automatic for this one, unfortunately. But yeah, I think manual would be ideal for uh, rally stages, but it's right. But yeah, this was actually quite rough. Because like, you gotta try and not slide too much. And yeah, not go into the corners too quickly. Because yeah, you just hit the wall basically. And it's got really tight corners. Really tight. Like sweeping corners as well. Like this one here, you gotta go like all the way down, really slow, yeah. And just sort of go around a bit more, yeah, real slow. So just slide the car a bit, and just, yep, straight. Let's go. And yeah, this corner, the sweeping corner, man, I had so many tries with this one. So you really have to slow down, and like stick right in the wall. I almost hit the wall there but yeah really just stick it in there not too much power coming out and then yeah now full full power full power Get a, yeah slide it there Ooh. and then just two more really tight corners before the end so this one's really really going all around so you can go all the way around then quickly right turn slide it in there and yeah straight down ah, this this was this was rough. 1 minute 42 is, yeah, it's pretty tight. But yeah, I did it in 1 minute 41.928. So yeah, really cutting it close. <laughs> Too close. So yeah, let's have a look at the uh, replay. I did hit the wall at the very, like, first corner, but it didn't register as a <laughs> crash. So I'll take it. But yeah, this corner, you gotta, like, turn in real early and, like, slide it in. I hit it there, but eh, I guess I'll take it. The game thinks it's okay, so eh, it's alright. So yeah, most of the time you gotta like turn really early, like before the corner. Look, ooh, just slide it in there. And you get a power over, it, and then just yeah, try and slide through. So yeah, let's have uh, really sweeping corners for this track. So and and tight ones too. So this one is like a really sweeping long corner, and then it goes into really tight. Like first gear, really drop it down. Not try not to slide so much, but yeah, just gotta really get the car around there, and not like slide. Cause like when you power over it, it's just yeah, it just slides too much. It doesn't go in a straight line. And this one is yeah, I had a lot of trouble with this one. So you actually, the main trick that I found for this one is stick it right in the wall, like on the right wall. So don't slide too much like on the outside and then when you come out you just yeah turn real early for this corner same thing stick on the left side and then this one you really have to just yeah, slow down to really cut that left corner real close and then the right corner I actually had to pull a handbrake there for like a few seconds because I was just sliding but luckily it was uh, yeah it was fast enough to uh, get to the final so yeah one minute and 42 is the gold for that one so yeah completed everything gold four sectors 39,000 for that one lap and then we'll get the uh, big price money everyone else you got three star so we got 200,000 for the bronze and one million credit for all gold so yeah really nice payout for this one guys so if you are uh, yeah up for a challenge this is really good i really like this new track actually it's probably one of my favorite now <laughs> and i said that with the other one as well but yeah just really nice and there's night time as well in that so i haven't i haven't tried the night time yet but yeah we'll suss it out later on but we do have two roulette tickets so yeah let's have a look at them it's only three stars so i'm not expecting much uh, rewards from this change money oh we got a car okay that's not too bad which was this one that's just the mazda atenza okay well thank you i shall take it 
and I actually don't have it yet. Maybe? I'm not sure. Oh yeah, let me get some points. Nice. Okay. Alright, one more time. Come on. Give us something nice. Oh, lots of gold bars. Okay. And a card as well. Oh. Ooh, okay. One go I think gold bars what hundred thousand? Pretty sure. Gold bars are good. Yeah, one hundred thousand. That's not too bad. That's actually Yeah, it's a good price money. But yeah, thank you so much for watching uh, Racers and hopefully you guys are having fun. And yeah, I did get a uh, invitation for the Aston Martin for one of the pools. So gonna start saving some money for this uh, 177 2011 and the Vulcan as well. So the Vulcan's 3 million. So yeah, we'll probably buy this 177 first. And then yeah, we'll see if we get enough cash for the other one. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Oh, there we go, 1.3. 1. 1. So yeah, I shared enough. Ooh, real world. That's nice. 46. Ooh, level 47. Let's go. I'm trying to aim for 49 to uh, get the uh, engine swap. So you can uh, start swapping engines. Would be really interesting. And thank you so much for your unyielding support as always, guys. And yeah, if you haven't yet subscribed for more Gran Turismo content, we shall be probably drifting this car soon. And I did get the uh, Pagani as well, the Huayra. So yeah, we shall check that out next time. And yeah, more of the circuit experience for a different track. I shall see you all next time. Alright, that is it for now. Bye-bye.